Mlago Specialized Women and Neonatal Hospital, a 450-bed capacity facility, is not able to provide some specialized services because it does not have the required human resource and equipment. Some of the vacant positions at the facility include those of laboratory attendants, medical officers, consultants, and senior consultants in fields like radiology, anesthesia, critical care, and pediatrics. The hospital has never acquired key diagnostic equipment like MRI and CT scan machines and some crucial supplies necessary for services and procedures like in vitro fertilization. The board members pledged to work towards resolving some of the challenges hindering service provision at the hospital. As board members, we need to oversee the procurement, storage, and utilization of all hospital goods and services, as well as essential medicine and health supplies. This financial year, additional resources have been provided to, to the institution to recruit additional staff, and, and we think that we'll be able to attract. You all know that government is in the process of enhancing salaries, and the purpose of this definitely is to attract not only the, the specialized human resources in Uganda, but even those who would want to come back to, to the country to deliver the services. The hospital's 2021-2022 financial year, 25.8 billion shillings budget, will be spent on wage, pension and gratuity areas, amounting to slightly over 10 billion shillings, recurrent non-wage expenditure at 12 billion shillings, and retooling capital development at 3.7 billion shillings. Walter Mwesije, NTV.